to this exclusive presentation of the Australian of the Year Awards on Nine in 2010. It is the 50th year of these outstanding awards. As a nation, we have celebrated the achievements and contributions of our leading citizens. It is our pleasure to welcome for the announcements our Prime Minister, Kevin Rudd. The Young Australian of the Year 2010 is Trooper Mark Donaldson, VC. Thank you very much. This, is, uh, this really is a great honour and uh, it fills me with uh, a lot of pride and uh, yeah, it means a lot. Um, before I just take a quick moment to thank those who are closest to me, they know who they are, but especially my, uh, my wife and daughter, Emma and Kaylee. If it wasn't for them, I wouldn't be here today. Uh, also, I'd just like to make a special mention to all those Australians who dedicate their lives and, and their very existence so that we can have our freedoms and we can have our way of life in this, the luckiest and I think the greatest country in the world. Thank you very much. And Australia's local hero for 2010 is Ronnie Khan. This is unbelievable. 22 years ago, when I came to make my new home in this country, I could never have imagined myself standing here today. I am passionate about investing and giving back to our community. I am passionate about Oz Harvest. I urge each and every one of you to do the most you can to give back to this extraordinary country because together we can make this country more fair, more inclusive and an even better country. We at Oz Harvest are dedicating to sharing food and without all the support we've always had, we could never get to where we are today. So thank you all. I am so proud and honoured to receive this award. Thank you, Australia. Have a wonderful Australia Day. The Senior Australian of the Year for 2010 is Maggie Beer. Thank you, thank you all. I mean, how, how incredibly humbled I am to be given this honour. I mean, with the, the, all of the people that are here that are just so amazing. We have had the most amazing time. And all I'm doing is what I love to do and being able to share it. But look, never underestimate, never underestimate the joy that cooking and sharing the table can bring nor that it is so much more than the sum of its parts. I challenge you all to think about food in a different way, to share your knowledge with all of those in your reach who aren't comfortable in knowing about food, to empower them to a good food life and all that that means because it changes lives. Thank you. <laughs> The Australian of the Year 2010 is Professor Patrick McGorry. Prime Minister and fellow Australians, this is a tremendous honour, one I want to share. I want to express my heartfelt thanks to my wife, Marilyn, my family, my sons, my sister who's here, my dedicated colleagues, the, the really courageous ones that have uh, contributed so much to this work and all the true believers of the mental health field. A psychiatrist as Australian of the Year, well, that's what I call climate change. Yes, good mental health is just as important as good physical health. Up to half of Australians will be affected by mental ill health during their lives. Three quarters of these people will be affected before the age of 25. So it's very important to get in early. You deserve a much better deal. Thanks to Australian innovation, we are at a tipping point. Australia now needs radical change to the system of care with early intervention as the core feature. Now, mental health is, is a team game. Mental health reform is a team game. I'm just one player. We need a level playing field. We need a fair go and a national commitment to change the landscape of mental health care in Australia. 
Out of the shadows, beyond the silence, we can achieve a new deal for all of us in Australia with mental illness. Thank you and enjoy Australia Day. Oh.